How's it going guys? Welcome back to Other Her Loving Embrace. I stopped at kind of a, a random point, I'm aware. <laughs> Sorry about that, but I'm I'm doing my best. It's I don't know when things uh, are going are going to like when a big story moment's gonna happen or anything, so I'm just kinda I'm kinda making it up as I go. If that somehow wasn't already quite clear. Oh, dang. No, okay, this is less less uh, confusing or difficult than I thought it would be. I think that's the, the only remaining movement I actually needed to make. Because now I should be able to bop it across there. Perfection. Oh. Oh, okay, okay. I didn't, I didn't even see that this was there, honestly. Uh, so I have to move this guy as well. I was about to super overcomplicate things. It's just a it's just a one a one step swap that needs to happen there. That is uh, hardly hardly a challenge. Well done, me. This doesn't look like much of a puzzle either. It's just a regular old bridge. Uh, I'm most I'm gonna I'm gonna avoid fighting those for now. Now that I'm maxed out in level. I don't really see the need. Might as well save up health and items and MP and all that stuff for, for moments when I feel like I truly need it. Huh. I didn't even notice that that path was there before. How did I end that? Weird. Weird how much I happened to overlook that. Huh. Yeah, okay. That's that's one of those permanent ones. That is like, that is solved now. I almost, I almost missed that. I may, may have like boxed myself out in a rather unfortunate way moving forward. Where am I? What is going on? <laughs> like, I clearly have this access point, but I don't... Oh! I can't teleport... I can teleport to the other side of those. Interesting. Doesn't really seem particularly limiting. I guess I had to open that up first, maybe? I, I, get, I probably have to hit a, a blob... Thing across. Oh wait, gotta teleport around to make this work. And then that will drop the two that are in the way of whatever the really giant thing is that I'm sliding around. It, I can like kind of see the order of operations of, of what I'm working towards here. But it's simultaneously not fully clear? Oh come on, that doesn't work all the time. Ugh. And now, see, now, now the fact that I have to switch between these quite often is making me really hate the the button layouts. the The designing of these puzzles suddenly has to be completely rethought, though, because I can I can like move around and access any any angle. So it's like if they didn't want me to stand in a certain spot, they would have to put a hole in the floor or like blocks or things. So it does have to be changed by quite a lot that's okay that's all I had to do there the first movement I did it's totally unnecessary don't know what this big-ass cannon looking thing actually is guess I'll just keep it moving hey there Misty just had a cat jump up in my in my lap uh-huh uh-huh and now what <laughs> wow this cannon's really big do you think it still works there's only one way to find out if we move it to an open spot, we can try it out. You ready to hush this puppy? Y'all, let's do it! Let's rock. I wonder if I could have done it elsewhere. Oh, cool. Goodbye, door. It looks like there's something shiny back there. Cool, okay. I wonder I wonder if I could have shot one of these walls or something. Like, there, might, there may have been a, a secret passage that I could have blown open by doing that. Too late now. That's fine. I was still able to access this like new uh, area I'll call it good I'll call that like a, a mission success oh wait where where the hell is this I'm like try I I sh blasted all the way up past all this didn't I I I kind of didn't realize how far the cannon actually had to shoot hmm may have been easier to get to than I was even realizing here we are Hey, look at the size of that, a blue chest. Bunch of old papers here. I don't really know what a sovereign edict is. Dude, it's a copy of the Celestron Declaration of Independence. You should have paid more attention in school. 
yeah, well, I don't know how old I am or how long the school system works in this world or whether or not you, like, influenced me to leave school. I don't know, man. I don't know what our relationship is. I don't know the, the history here. Looks like a bunch of research notes. Something about regeneration magic? Signed, Maria. I guess she was in charge here. We are in her office. You found the grip bracelet. You can now jump off walls in battle. Oh, that's kind of awesome. This is a permanent upgrade, so you don't need to equip it. Oh, that's really cool. I thought I thought I would earn new skills and things like that. I kind of want to go into battle because I want to put that to the test a little bit. And of course, it puts me in a, a room where there's not really walls to be jumped off of. Ooh. But that's really cool. I was not anticipating battle to change in ways other than uh, spells and skills and things. So I kind of want to do that. Whoa! Okay. Turns out it's even grippier than I thought it would be. Dang it. Dang it. <laughs> oh God. Got to be quick there. That was kind of great, though. Uh, there's There's been quite a few times where I felt kind of, like, left behind. Where I... Uh, wasn't able to easily like if I didn't pull off a perfect uppercut attack or whatever then I wasn't able to get at the enemy that I like exactly directly how I wanted to so having wall jumps might make all the difference there with with accessing some of those difficult to reach parts of the battle okay so now that I've done that now what I can't put these like stones into bubbles can I nothing like that Oh, I probably have to shoot that cannon at this. There's like, there's for sure a through line, like all the way down through that, that I, I would be able to, look at that. That's like where the wall jumping is so huge. That saves me so much time, like jumping around, navigating in there. So that's super awesome. But, oh, I accidentally dashed into it. That was so dumb. There, I can do it again right away. So convenient. Uh, but yeah, I, I really hope there's a, an effective way for me to to move that back into place Because it kind of seemed like I didn't have a way to get back to the other side of it now that I had pushed it to that one particular location uh, Yes, of course Beautifully going in the wrong direction as per usual. Gotta pay better attention to the sparkles there. I bailed myself out of a, a little bit of a free fall there by wall jumping I'm stoked about that because that's totally like that's totally like a missable, optional extra part of the game. Hard to call it a secret because it's quite apparent and easy to see. But yeah, you could totally not do that. <laughs> so I, I I think it's a little bit secretive. Yeah, there's this through line all the way through here, presumably uh, going back to where there's that track. Hmm. It's only gonna work though if I make sure that uh, these these are down. I mean, maybe it would be able to shoot its way through those, but I kind of suspect that only the old, like, decrepit ones covered in weeds would be breakable. There is a possibility as well that I would have to lower those in some way, and then it would shoot, like, the door or grate behind it. Oh. Oh, I see. We'll try the, the basic version of it first, where I don't have to do that. Oh god, I'm so glad I remembered to lower those, or else I would have to go all the way back around. Alright, now we should be able to- you ready to grill this chicken? He's got like a different little phrase for each time. All the raised gates, and maybe- oh sick, it blasts through- it blasts through both. We did it! That door is history! I wonder what's back there. Let's shoot it again! You ready to light this candle? <laughs> I kind of just want to see what his, his fun extra little phrases are. Blam! It doesn't, nothing happens. Ready to grill this chicken? Uh, no, not yet. Dude, buzzkill. <laughs> I, I just, I just wanted to hear your different cool action, ready to rock style phrases are, you know? And accessing the next, more, more notes. There's a lot of scattered notes throughout this area. These wretched slaves. I can't believe they managed to barricade us in here. I'm not worried though. It's only a matter of time before reinforcements come and get us out. I bet it'll be less than a day. Ah, <laughs> uh, seems like you guys all died down here. Nothing special, just a dead body. Oh right, of course. Nothing special at all. No, no concerns whatsoever. Candidate cells. Hmm. Wonder, wonder what that means. Candidates for experimentation in the lab, perhaps? 
I don't care what everyone else thinks, what nonsense it all was. Solas, forgive me. So that it's more and more of Solas coming up again. Maybe that wouldn't be the woman we saw, would it? In the vision? I would doubt it. I would doubt it. We were so close. True independence was within our grasp. Curse you. Who are you cursing? Give me, give me more deets. It's difficult for me to piece this together. Oh, this is straight up the symbol from the game's uh, logo. It looks kind of like a throne or something. The text is muddled from age. Very little of it is legible. Of the process, which is impossible without the assist assistance of lay energy, the surrogate was intended for centuries of performance. The rest is too worn out to read. It's a coffin? Not sure what else it could be. It's the right size and shape. Same, same dealio. Can, actually, can I read these? Weirdly carved box. Looks like it's hooked into the lay point. You can see some sort of lay point? Hey, okay, is this movable? It kind of looks like there are tracks there. Ah, not quite. Thought, thought I was being so clever. Nothing special, just a dead body. Wow, look at all these jars and bottles. I bet they had held all sorts of magic potions. They're all empty now, though. Looks like research having to do with lay energy. We've been locked in this damn room for almost two weeks. Everyone has given up hope. It's over. Except for Maria. She doesn't seem to care. Does she know something we don't? Yeah, she knew how to grip walls. That was her main claim to fame. Spooky. This whole place is creepy. I say spooky, you say creepy. Agree to disagree. Seems like some really bad things were happening here. Yeah, you can say that again. Okay. Please, don't. I'm sure there's another exit around here if we just keep looking. Yeah, I bet you're right. We'll be out of here before you can say... Can say... Uh, there was an ever so tiny, like, eyebrow adjustment as he was trying to think harder. Yo, you good? I feel it again, that, that weird feeling from the vision. Yeah. We gonna get a little snippet of her again? Or maybe she's here. Maybe we were just gonna straight up see her. What the? Somebody's coming. It's getting stronger. What a stroke of fortune. I thought I'd be down here forever. Show yourself now. Who are you? <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, she kind of glides and ah, uh, character designs in this game are cool. So, this is your reward for my patience. Despite me once again, I'm beginning to think you do have a sense of humor after all. Hey lady, I asked you a question. Who are you? Did you trap us down here? Oh, Jesus, holy shit. <laughs> okay. Whoa, I'll raid it in there. Hey, <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. Whenever he does this, it looks like he's doing like a, hello, is anybody there? Like miming a phone call? <laughs> sorry. You won't catch me off guard. Last chance to back off, freak show. Solus. If I can't harm you, are one of us Solus? Like reincarnated or something? There's all that stuff about regeneration and I don't know. I'll make you watch as I destroy your precious children. One by one. Piece by piece. It doesn't matter what happens to me. As long as you suffer, we've already won. You're really something. It's rude to ignore people you know. I don't typically injure, injure elderly women, but today I'll make an exception. Gershom, let's take her down. I don't know if that seems like a great idea. Prepare yourself. Dude, she's got lightning fingers, okay? It's a little bit intense. I don't know. A barrier to trap the opponent, to teleport and slice at the opponent. I'll try and use a barrier first. Oh god. Uh, oh, grow the shield. Okay, bap, bap, bap. Okay, so I just had to hit it like a bunch of times while it was in the window. The enemy's stuck inside the barrier. Okay, that seems good. That seemed like a good call then. Talk smack, get whacked. Oh, whoops. Oh, I can't do damage when she's in the barrier. Either that or, like, literally, I can't do damage. Broke out of the barrier. Well, shit. Let's see. Let's see if Gershom's able. Okay, okay. The barrier might have actually protected her. So, that was didn't seem like a great move on my part. Enemy strikes at Gershom. Ha ah, ah, ha, okay. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. What the hell? 
<laughs> okay, okay. They're staggered away, but for a second, all of them were lit up, and I was like, I don't know what to do. I'm boned. I'm gonna die. Uh, that was just a little bit more complicated than I was expecting. Shit! No, oh, I really, I really gotta lunge to make that work. Okay. Let the first one happen, then you just gotta move. Okay. Whew. That one was really, like, shocking. Shocking the first time it came up, and I had no idea what I needed to do to, to get away from that. But now, now that I've seen it once, it's not so bad. Oh, shit. The way it wraps around the walls there was kind of unexpected. Gershom should probably, probably heal on his next turn. All right, must dash. Oh, no, he just straight up can't hurt her. Enemy attacks the wizard. I don't know what you're about to do. Wall jump, wall jump, wall jump. <laughs> damn it, damn it, damn it, damn it, damn I wonder if I could have just hugged up on the wall there and if I would have been fine. I think I, I, think I better use a, a mushroom here or else I'm risking things a little bit too much. Wall jump? If I literally just ride the wall, can you jump up at me? You can cheese that attack so hard when you've gone and gone and retrieved the grip bracelet. That's uh, it's good for me to know. Bluster to boast body and soul? Do you know what? I think I will. Because currently I cannot hurt her. So I think I need to try that. Oh, I wasn't expecting it to be like gambling based. Alright, so it's kind of a little bit randomized. Not quite. Alright, I can learn this. It's after the second whiz. Whiz, whiz, damn it! Nuts. Alright, so I may have still raised it a little bit. Plus one. I hope you have good insurance. Enemy attacks the wizard. Alright, I'm peacing out. <laughs> Nothing you can do if I just ride up the wall. I'm a genius. I'm hoping with uh, improved body that um, wizard will actually be able to attack. Because I'm going to run out of MP too quickly to be able to continually like do... I, I, I can't rely entirely on magic, right? I have to try and actually do something here. Oh, even when it's improved like that, I still can't. Alright, now I was just kind of mashing buttons trying to remember how in the hell to... Oh, shit. It came around too quickly to wall jump out of the way properly. Uh... I lost track of what I was saying. Something about the fact that I wasn't able to do what I was intending to, though. It, was, it wasn't working out super well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm button mashing, just trying to remember how the... Isn't, wasn't it just holding the buttons to do special skills? How the hell do I not remember how to do that properly? Oh, fuck. I moved too soon. Okay, definitely need to heal on the next next one. Yeah. Get back here. I'm trying to, I'm trying to dash at her. Oh, I managed to get one, one more quick shot in. Must wait, then move. It only, it only has time for two, though. All right. You super need to heal. The mush biscuit's the way to go. Attacking the wizard. It's not too tough when I start in a position. Okay, a third one was starting there. I was, I, I moved just in case that might happen. Trap you in the corner there. Dash, dash, dash. I'm so bad at doing the dashes. I'm mashing, mashing the direction button, trying to pull it off, and it doesn't seem to go great. It's not. I can't, I can't do it consistently enough. I guess, I guess I gotta try and use more MP skills, because the fighting, fighting is just nothing. You're, we gotta rely on you, Gershom. You're, you're the, you're the big dog in this situation here. Ah, <laughs> oh, the music stopped for a second. I thought maybe it was putting an end to it. I really, I really do need to try and use a charged up attack, though. Skill, punch, if I get a couple of godlike timings. Oh, okay, okay. I can I can do damage that way. Alright, thought maybe that would go on a little bit longer. Just had to do a big finisher, apparently. <sighs> ah, yeah. You like that? I've grown weak. The years have not been kind to my power. I must recover. She gonna use... A similar, t uh, I thought she was going to use a teleportation that was like really similar to the one I have. Yeah, you better run. Get lost. Whew. She's a monster. I don't know if I could do that again. I'm officially in too deep. First chance I get, I'm gone. The town can find some other stooges to solve their crap. Wizard, you're not going to stick this through, man? That lady. Who was she? I have no idea. To be honest, I don't really care. 
She's getting away! It sounded like she wanted to hurt more people. <sighs> I, yeah, I agree. Let's follow up on this. See if we can resolve anything here. I can't believe it. An emergency exit! We finally found a way out of here. Dude, we can go back. We're free of this dungeon crap. Do you not care? I thought you'd be excited. We're gonna keep going, right? Sorry? We can't let her get away. We have to follow her, don't we? What? Are you crazy? Why on earth would we want to do that? Let's go back now! <laughs> what? Are you kidding? Think about it. We gotta strike while well, she's weak, dude. I don't know anything about who she is or why she's down here. She could be behind the whole spirit problem for all we know. Dude, haven't you had enough of this? We gave it our best shot. Besides, we let her out, right? If she gets back to her full strength, she could be even more dangerous. What just happened to my mouth? <laughs> more dangerous, more full strength, more dangerous. The spirits in Chestertown would be nothing compared to her. I, come on, man. If she could hurt anybody else, it'd be all our fault. Stop. Don't you feel even a little guilty? Aren't you supposed to be here to help us? Stop. I can't believe you. You just want to run away? I said stop. Don't make me repeat myself. We're going back now. Aren't you supposed to be my assistant? I'm not letting some kid boss me around. Some kid? I'm not running a charity, Gershom. We're in over our head. Let's go. No. I beg your pardon? I said no! I'm staying here and I'm gonna get to the bottom of this. I may be scared, but I'm not a, a coward like you. I'll go on ahead by myself if I have to. You can run like a kid back to Chestertown if you want. And when you get back, you can tell everyone how you left me behind. Curse him! You idiot! Fine, we'll keep going, if that's what you want. It is. <sighs> We're not gonna run in there anyways. I'm sure there's lots more stuff we can find to help us. We're only gonna go in when we're 100% ready. Alright. That big battle was like a very logical end point for the demo in my mind, so I'm curious what else it is planning to like fold into the story at this point. Like, what more does the demo feel like it needs to show or tell in order to like sell me on the concept of this game? Because I'm sold. I'm, I've been sold for quite some time. The story uh, has been, it's been, it's been all right. But like the characters were immediately cool. The battle and everything is incredible. It's interesting that it's giving me more. Maria's notes, faded and worn plus 50% charge and something else. What was the other thing? No meter build. So my meter starts, like not the experience, the battle meter starts at 50 and I can't, Stack it further. I think that I think that's what it's saying. It makes sense. It's very bloody. It's a it's a messy looking book you got there, Maria. Uh, I'm going to equip it just to test out that it works the way I think it would. But I see no reason to think that it wouldn't operate in that way. What is this little? Was that there before? If it was, I I don't know if I literally couldn't see it or if I just didn't know how to access it. Neat. The, the connective stuff lacing all this together so you don't have to backtrack quite so much is much appreciated. Ah, yeah, I want to duck into this little lecture room. It's a list of names. Doesn't mean much to me. It's some sort of, like, sacrificial altar here. I wonder what kind of awful stuff is written in this book. Oh, it's just a joke book. Wow, these are really awful jokes. Now I'm going to read me one. The text is smudged and faded with age. Very little is legible. Unsurprisingly, lay energy has been found to be critical for cultivation. The severed tissue responds to restorative magic, but only in the presence of lay energy. The rest is too worn to read. This body looks weird. Yeah, it's one of those strange bodies we've been seeing down here. Huh. It's in pieces, but the bones don't appear to be broken at all. I wonder why it was tied to the table. Yeah, they're up to some shady business down here. If you guys hadn't noticed. 
Take that. <laughs> you stupid gate. You're so incapable. Just terrible at its job of, of keeping me out. <laughs> the cat's like pacing back and forth across my lap right now. So there's just a tail that's occasionally altering uh, its path across. Oh goodness, I thought I was going to generate a puzzle to have to solve because that's what that those marks on the floor always m mean. And it looked real convoluted. Luckily it didn't end up actually being anything. Are any of these... They look like they might be little access points. A lay point. Okay. Oh, and that's the symbol from the game again and from the... the posters or whatever we've been seeing now I kind of I'm looking over at like, like face cam connection and like I, I think it's cool how you can see the pulse of blue like going across my face it's kind of neat wow it's beautiful now I know why these things are so treasured Gershom look about earlier wizard Ooh, yeah that's what I'm saying man that wasn't the lady again, was it? Oh, yep, yep. Well, that takes care of him. What an idiot. Damn it. This is no place for children. Why did you even come here? For the lay power, perhaps? Why are you doing this to us? Answer me, runt. Or do you wish for a fate worse than your friends? What has befallen this world in my absence? Who are you? Where are you from? I, I... This lady, she's pure evil. This isn't fair at all. How can somebody be like this? Solas, please give me courage. I don't know what to do. S sorry, I'm, I'm not supposed to t talk to strangers? A good defense, Gershom. It's rude to ask questions before introducing yourself? <laughs> Normally, I loathe disobedience, but given the circumstances, your resolve is commendable. Very well. My name is Maria. Oh, shit. I was wondering if maybe this was her and she was the one doing the experiments and everything. But considering that the evidence was almost pointing to Maria had died, uh, I was wondering if maybe Maria was uh, created this or summoned her or something and was killed in the process. All right. I am, was, in charge of this facility. Eleventh seat on the Celestrian High Council. We were granted perfect knowledge. With it, we made a perfect choice. Now you know the name of your tormentor. Grant me the name of my prey, little boy. Prey? Is this just a game to her? Of course it is. She doesn't care about anybody except herself. What a rotten, evil person. Who does she think she is? Maria. I've had it with you. Oh, gear up for this shit. Listen up. My name is Gershom. I may be small, but I've got guts and a big axe. <laughs> Not a big heart or anything, the axe. I'm done being scared. I'm sick of getting pushed around. I won't let you hurt my friend or anybody else. Really now? <laughs> so, the little spawn wants to be a man. <laughs> Truthfully, I will relish this encounter. It's been centuries since I've had this much fun. Oh, da I have to actually go solo on this? I thought for sure I wouldn't have to do it. Child, you have earned the enmity of Celestra, and with it, your wretched demise. Whoa, okay, we're getting like a full-on battle stage here. Holy shit! So now, now we're no longer like turn-based, we're actually having like, ah, oh, shit, 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 shit. <laughs> Not good. Okay. This is awesome. This game is the coolest. Shit, shit, I thought the wall jumping would be such a good strategy for avoiding that. And I still think it kind of was. Oh yeah, she's tired. Lay in the attacks while I still can. Oh yeah, juggle, juggle a little bit. I'll kick her up on the wall. Shit, shit, she also managed to get an attack off on me there. I don't know how, I don't think I can like access items or anything, so maybe I should be a little bit more careful. That's kind of cool, because the game totally introduced me to how that attack was going to behave in the game. Like I knew that when she used that it would run up the walls like that, since I would seen it previously. Even though the other ones, the other things I'm seeing are like behaving differently. 
Oh, you God damn you! <laughs> to try to land these attacks. All right, flee, 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 flee. Oh God. Okay. I oh, don't. No, no, no. I jumped too soon. I jumped too soon. Shit. The end. All is well. All is not well. Ah. Oh, no. When did? When did I? When did I? When did I saved last? Shit. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I. I have the ability to try this again. I kind of wish the game would note that I've seen this before and provide me with an option to, to skip it. That kind of works in a weird way though, because like, according to the save state, uh, this is where it would have to push me back to. Oh, don't chew my headphone cord, you little brat. Um, that it would, it would allow me to just like jump straight back into the battle for a second try, you know, something like that. Just for convenience's sake, and give me the option to say no and go back to the save point if I decide that I want to go get better gear or grind for a higher level or something before a battle. But yeah, make me click all through this again. Not a big fan of that. The like 3D parallax that happens as as this little battle begins is super cool. Come on! God damn it, I just got hammered there. I was trying to make like a big escape. And I just got mangled. This is going so much worse than last time even. Like, jeez. Oh, having to watch that again sucks. I mean, I guess I don't know how it would work uh, on a keyboard, like if you were playing that way, but seeing as I'm in a controller. Oh, I can dash with the trigger button. Okay, the way I've been doing it up until now is so stupid by comparison. <laughs> this should make a pretty massive difference. Oh crap, she uses a lightning move during this as well. Whoop. Get back here, you. The the most dangerous stuff. Oh, I, I used my bubble move. <laughs> like Squirtle. Uh, didn't, I don't even know really how I achieved that little combo actually. Her, her most dangerous thing that she does seems to be uh, her little, like, close-up close, close -up attack, where when I'm like, damn it, I'm trying to bash off a bunch of hits at her, and then she just, like, straight-up attacks me, she doesn't, like, wind up for a skill or anything. Like, when she does that, then I at least, like, know that something's coming and can uh, be prepared for it and get out of the way. It's when she just suddenly, like, fights back that uh, is the most dangerous. Shit, that was a terrible dodge roll. Oh, that went really well. That was good. See, that one. That one where she just dashes at me. Yep. <laughs> That's the one that scares me the most. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 she's going for it. She's going for the dash thing. Mm, I was so close. Come on. Damn it. That was... I, I should have backed off. I should have backed off when I, as soon as I saw that she was going for that. Once I remembered that you can do the dash with the trigger, then I was I was doing it too often, and I wasn't using it, like, I wasn't timing it well, I was just kind of spamming it, so that was a poor choice. I'm making this battle harder, harder than it should be. I should have, realistically, I should have won on, like, the first or second try. <laughs> Running up and down the wall is by far the easiest way to deal with the little, her little donuts, donut spells there. Way to make it sound so incredibly uh, non- terrifying. Like that it's uh, the least concerning attack imaginable. Oh, she only did two that time. Gives me plenty of opportunity to retaliate then. And a bailing because she's she's gearing up for her shit. Yep. Yeah, none of that. Thanks. Think I'll just make my way on out of there. I'm all juiced up with my like uh, own charged up uh, power bar. And I feel so stupid that I can't remember how to use it properly. Oh, that was some dumb shit that I just did diving at her in the middle of that attack. Pretty much begging to be, <laughs> to lose the battle there. Okay. Okay. I didn't play very smart there. Kind of, kind of lucky. Oh man, she's really beat up. <sighs> uh, how could you? Well, you killed Mr. Wizard. I'm real mad. What a joke! Yeah, I got it from that joke book that I found earlier. Do you like it? <laughs> what a cruel joke! My town is being attacked by spirits. Do you know anything about it? I've been stuck down here for centuries. They could be after anything. Ah, idiot! How stupid are you? 
stupid enough to fight you and win, I guess. Well, asking her was worth a try. Gershom, I hate you. I hate you. I will never. Never do anything about it, I guess, because it seems like you're done. She... She's not moving. I... I had to, right? What am I supposed to do now? Is she going to come back as a spirit? Kershom. Oh, wizard? <laughs> I'm still here. I'm not feeling too hot, though. Don't, don't move. You're hurt. I'll be... Okay. She did a number on my skull, though. She didn't have anything to do with the spirits. I heard. I doubt she was very honest, but I don't think she was lying. At least she's gone now. Still have no idea what she wanted. <laughs> uh, so, we didn't accomplish a single thing. This trip turned out to be a big waste of time, huh? No, it didn't. What? The lay point. Don't tell me you still want to. Kershom, you really don't have to do it. Well, Maria's kind of out of the picture now, so maybe it'll be safe. I don't know what's going on anymore. I just know what the people I care about are, are in danger. I don't want anybody I care about getting hurt. And if I can help it, I will. <sighs> Maybe there's still some hope for this to work after all. Here we go. Man, the story in this is coming together. I don't like. I hardly know what's going on, but I'm so fascinated. Kershom, you doing okay there? I'm not afraid. Gershom! What's going on? Gershom! Now that's gotta be where the demo ends, right? Ah, damn it! What is happening? <laughs> God damn! That game is so cool and fascinating and fun. <sighs> Neat. I, I, I like don't understand at all, but I love absolutely every single little thing about it. I'm so happy to know that it was successfully kickstarted. The full game is supposedly like years away. It's going to be a lot of work, but damn, if this is any indicator of what we have to look forward to, this is going to be so, so awesome. I hope you guys are as, as excited about it as I am. Again, something I brought up in the first episode. This is a free demo. I'll have links. You can check that out for yourself down below. Uh, go secret hunting. Cause it, I, there's like a good chance I missed things, you know? Man, that final battle would be hard without wall jumping. I used that a ton in the end there. That's, that's cool. I'm so stoked on this. <laughs> so glad to come back to it, too. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you again soon.